Okay, let me talk about my project. I work for a uh, software development company and my company's name is Fleet Apps Company. And uh, Fleet, we are providing Fleet uh, management services for the other companies as a software development company. And Fleet management refers to the overall actions that take place to keep a fleet running efficiently on time and within budget and I can define uh, the fleet management as the process used by the fleet managers to monitor fleet activities and costs and uh, and also in order to define a company as a fleet company uh, it must have uh, at least five or more vehicles in its own uh, company. So we are, as a company, we are just uh, providing services for the transport and distribution companies, rental and leasing companies, as well as food delivery companies. As I said to you, uh, my company that I'm still working for is is software development company and so our domain is fleet domain uh, our company's software mainly focuses on improving customer service organizing vehicles data keeping drivers safe with a vehicle tracking system and making fleet safe with a gps system and also we are providing services uh, for the cost management uh, things. And uh, when it comes to talk about my project, uh, as I said to you, my project is fleet management project. And uh, it has so many features like customer account management, user employee info management, create contract via the application, manage vehicle information, communication, as well as calendar, event creation, announcements, etc. So let me tell or talk about my project in details. Uh, as I said to you, we are providing so many uh, services and the first one is customer account management. So the customers can create uh, their own accounts like names, their addresses, IDs or locations, etc. And another um, service that we are providing is about user employee info management. So any user or employee can add, update or delete their own information, as I said, like name, address, ID, location, etc. And um, Again, another service is all about creating contract via the application. So uh, by using this uh, feature of this application, our application, managers and drivers can create contract and the document is saved just in the application, in, in our own application. And another service that we are providing as a company is managing vehicle information. So uh, the employees, the drivers or the managers in, in the company can create or edit a new car by editing their plug number, odometer, year, model, cost of any car, of the new car. And another service is about uh, providing communication. Uh, so uh, the drivers, managers, all the employees and employers uh, in that company can communicate with each other by text message or voice and video calls. And last but not least, uh, another service is about providing calendar event creation announcement uh, features in our application. So right now I am working for uh, fleet apps company my company as an automation test engineer mostly i'm doing uh, automation testing maybe i can say that 70 percent of my all testing is about automation and the rest is about manual testing 
So I, I have started working for this company uh, since May 2022, and I'm still working for this company. Uh, as I said to you, my company is a software development company, and it's a startup company which has several applications, as I said to you. The application I work is fleet management, which is a web-based application for customers to handle all kinds of management of logistics, including but not limited managing and tracking deliveries of the vehicles, as well as renting for the business use. So it enables the business user to replacement of the vehicles and tracking all insurance and registration related issues. There are some other features which makes our application unique like damage and maintenance management. So if the car has an accident, then uh, also the driver or the manager can use our application uh, in terms of damage and maintenance management. I am currently in a team uh, who is responsible for the fleet module, which is handling contract management and vehicle information. And the application has API driven engine, which allows users access through a Java API or REST web uh, service and outputs puts results in XML, JSON or Pojo. It also has a database layer uh, with Oracle. We use POM Cucumber framework for automating testings. So my main resp responsible responsibility in the team is to maintain the framework, regression suite, and smoke test, as well as in sprint automation testing. Uh, let me give you uh, some examples about uh, the user stories that we are creating. For example, for the front-end user story, uh, let me give a couple of examples. Like, as a manager, I want to create a new car so that I can track its status. Or another example for the front-end user story is, um, as a driver, I want to update the vehicle or car car's odometer and let me give one more example about the front-end user story as a user i want to view all the models of the car so what about for the uh, back-end user stories let me give you a couple of examples about the api user stories like as a manager i want to add a new car in this case, I need to use, of course, POST method in the API. Uh, another example is, as a driver, I want to update the vehicle odomit odomit odometer. So I need to use patch method in API, you know, postman. And another example for the API user story is, for example, as a user, I want to view all the models of the car. So in this case, I need to use get method. Last but not least, let me give a couple of examples about database user stories of, in our company, in our team. For example, as a manager, I want a new car added to my Oracle database. Or another example is, as a driver, I want to update the vehicle odomet odometer in my database. Or let me give one more example about a database user story. As a user, I want to view a list of models of the cars in the database. Uh, I think that's all about my project. Thank you for listening. Thank you so much.